constituencies that have concluded their branch elections. We want to uh, give them permission to open nominations, open nominations for the constituency elections from Monday, 7th May to 11th May. So for five days, anybody who aspires to pick a form to contest at the constituency level can go to their constituency offices, to their designated officials, and pick a form to complete. By the end, by, from 26 May, no, they will be they will be vetting after the five days. We would we would expect that constituency vetting will be concluded by 26 May. So if you have sold all your forms within the first five days, you are free so long as you have agreement among your constituency executives, you are free to fix the time of your vetting. But we expect that by 26 May, all vetting of candidates in all constituencies in the country would have been concluded. That will give time for people who may have been vetted out who may have been disqualified for one reason or the other to put in their appeal. And again, the appeal will go to, uh, you know, regional and, and so on and so on, up to national. The appeal process is clearly indicated in our, in our uh, you know, constitution. We don't expect that the appeal process will, will come that far. Majority of the appeals may end at the regional level. But we think that by the end of 31st May, all appeals would have been dealt with. At the end of the appeal process and the end of the vetting process, we will then ballot for positions on the ballot paper. And then our elections, constituency elections, are scheduled for 23rd June. You try as much as possible that in all the 275 constituencies, our elections will be held on 23rd of June.